guys, it's me, Debs, and I'm coming to you with another video. This is going to be called um, Boba Straw Set on Natural Hair. I am going to be using Boba Straws. Um, these are Boba Straws right here. Um, they are the straws that you can find in boba tea at um, a lot of the Asian cafes and such. Um, I've already gotten started with my hair because this is not going to be an easy task and I'm trying to stay kind of structured in how I am setting the curls. In my mind, I know what I want it to look like, so I'm trying to keep a pattern going here. Um, so, so far I have put a few in my hair already. Um, I just secured them with some bobby pins, as you can see from the roots. And there's another one there. So I'm going to show you how I am rolling it. Um, by the way, please excuse my face, okay? Because I just came out the shower and I'm all up in your grill looking jacked up. My bad. Sorry. Okay? So, okay, here we go. I'm going to take about, I don't know, that much of hair. Let me take a little bit out. Yeah, that much. And then I'm going to just kind of clip this to the back to get it out the way for now. Um, my hair has been washed already and um, deep conditioned. And I put my Cantu leave-in shea moisture, whatever that stuff is called. And then I'm putting... Um, my flaxseed gel on top of each piece of hair. So there is my flaxseed gel. And if you want to know what it is or you want to see a video on it, I do have a video um, for how to make flaxseed gel. So I will put that in the description box as well. So here I am. I'm going to take my denim brush, well, my fake little denim brush. I don't know what this is called. It's a bootleg version. Whatever, them dumb brushes are expensive, okay? All right, so there's my hair. Whoa, my hair is getting long. <laughs> okay, so one end is pointy, and then one end is just regular. So I'm going to um, go from the regular end, the regular circular end, and I'm just going to, let me start over, wrap it around itself first so that it holds. Ugh. Just like that. Let's just kind of wrap it around and then I'm going to start taking it up like so in a spiral kind of motion. Booyah. Okay, so I've got it right there secure and now it's kind of this big piece out here so I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to clip the top piece that's sticking out now you want to make sure that your hair is all kind of like tucked in there so you don't cut your hair and then I just clip it and it's gonna fly somewhere <laughs> Now this looks like a really long process because I'm doing it on camera, but this I did so fast. I really thought it was going to take a long time, but um, it's really not that bad. I'm thinking it'll probably take me about 40 minutes to get all these done. So there. There it is. Yes. Yes. It's going to be so cute. Oh, you're going to like it. You're going to like it. There you go. I'll be right back. I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of my hair. I'll come back, show you what it looks like with all the rollers in. At the very end of the video, there will be pictures, so stay tuned. Hey guys, I'm back. So I rolled all my hair. I sat on the dryer for like an hour, and now I'm going to take the rollers down and see what's cooking under these curls, under these straws. So, um... I've got a little bit of avocado oil that I'm going to put on my hand so that I won't get any frizz, which with my luck, I probably will still get frizz. Um, I'm going to take this first one down. 
Ooh. Oh, wait. Oh, this is going to be fun. Okay, so those are all the rollers. All of them are out, and now I'm going to fluff. Okay, so here we go. Put the oil in my hand again. Okay, I'm gonna go to the mirror, fluff out a little bit more, and I'll be right back. Here we go. I have um, separated them, and I have taken my fingers and just kind of pulled it up to give more volume here, like that. I've got um, a clamp here, and put another one right here just because I want the curl to lay down just a little bit to give me like a kind of thing. But overall, I, I love it. I love it. And you know what? Um, the flaxseed gel is a really, really, really good option to use as a, um, a way to set the hair. On my edges, I have the Aveda um, um, edge Oh, control paste. That's what it is. Aveda control paste. And I use it on my edges. How about that? I just want to take a moment to thank all my new subscribers. Hello. Thank you so much for subbing. And hello to all my beautiful people out there. I thank you guys so, 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 so very much for watching my videos. And follow me on Instagram. If you don't follow me, Go down to the box below and follow me. There will be a link. But, um, I'm sorry, I can't keep my hands up my hair. I'm like in love right now. Um, like, oh my God, I can't focus. I just love my hair. Yeah, so, yeah. More videos coming soon. I've got some really good ideas and some more things that I want to do with you guys. Um, anyway. Thanks again for watching. I feel like I'm accepting a Grammy award or something. I can't end this video. Till next time. Peace.